एक जापान में है एक इंसान मासा सान या दैट्स वेयर माय रिसर्च बिगिन Masayoshi Son announced the Vision Fund 100 billion dollars Vision Fund's biggest investments Uber and WeWork uh Masas had a challenging few years with mm -hmm. his investments <laughs> So when you told people you were going to raise a 100 billion dollar fund did they tell you you were a little crazy Oh well, some people said <laughs> Yes, Masa Sun. He successfully gathered 45 billion dollar in just one hour. No, no, it's not true. 45 minutes, 45 billion dollar. Okay. He became the richest man in the world for straight three days, and then thunderstruck. He loses almost 70 billion dollars overnight, or who human history may sabse bada personal loss tha. Many says Masa is a rich gambler. who runs business on casino table masa ne entrepreneurs pe billions of dollars invest kiya hai sirf unki aankhon pe spark dekhte hue apne surroundings pe aap jitne bhi companies dekhte hai those all are connected with this masa san as we all are business aspirant here we should know who is this masa san and his soft bank moreover he is leading his life on a risky path and his story is the most fascinating one you all have ever heard and above all he is crazy Is he the world's most astute tech investor, or is he the luckiest guy on the planet? His story begins when their family flee to Japan from South Korea, the place where new to them, different language, no food, and no place to stay. His father did all odd jobs for their need and due to different in culture Masa's childhood friend threw rocks at him from very childhood wo apne liye ek acha life chahte the after completing his middle school he was determined to become the most successful businessman in Japan his idol was Den Fujita who pulled the string to bought McDonald's in Japan back in 1971 he wanted to talk with Mr Den but unfortunately he was facing rejection over phone then He fled to Tokyo. Okay, this is waste of my telephone bill. So I flew in to Tokyo and I said I came because the the phone call become becoming more expensive than air ticket. Mr. Den was so impressed by his determination that he flew to his office to meet him. He sat with him for almost 15 minutes where Masa asking for advice. Yeah. What business should I do? Computer. That's the one. If I were you at your age at this Den said he should go to US for his business study he took those advice to his heart and only at the age of 16 he went to california to pursue his dreams he learned english and took admission to an american high school and within few weeks he realized that this process gonna take too long so he somehow managed his teacher to give the entrance exam of college although masa san was brilliant but he was not prepared for the exam but he somehow managed to scribble down on that paper and pass the exam and yahan se the things went straight up he went for economics and computer studies at the university of and for money he called his friend like us but not for borrowing money he was asking for advice that how he can earn 10000 dollar a month by working just 5 minutes a day i know that sound ridiculous but that was masa san what is the best most efficient use of my time it's invention so i set alarm clock 5 minutes as i said come invention come <laughs> He spent 5 minute every day for his new invention idea so he could patent them and sell them on. He wrote a book of almost 250 new invention ideas. 5 minutes ke ideas se invention nahi ho sakta ye sabko pata hai. Lekin sabhi ideas kharab nahi hote. He decided his best idea was the portable device which can translate any text into any other languages. Abhi the question is Masa itne easily invention ideas kaise sochte the Now listen to me carefully wo ideas ke liye ye teen approach use karte the First finding solution for the problem that he is facing in his daily life For example ek goal pen table se bar bar gir jata hai Agar iska shape hexagonal ya triangle kar diya jaye to we can prevent it from rolling off Secondly change the way you looking at things मतलब प्रस्पेक्टिव फॉर एग्जाम्पल एक बड़े चीज को छोटा कर देना या एक छोटा चीज को बड़ा कर देना और चेंजिंग द कलर हिज थर्ड अप्रोच वॉज कॉम्बाइनिंग एग्जिस्टिंग प्रोडक्ट फॉर एग्जाम्पल कॉम्बाइनिंग रेडियो विद टेप रिकॉर्डर एंड दैट विल इवेंचुअली बिकम अ रेडियो टेप रिकॉर्डर देन मासा मेड दैट पोर्टेबल डिवाइस विद द हेल्प ऑफ अ फिजिक्स प्रोफेसर एंड स्टार्टेड पिचिंग कंपनीज टू बाई हिज न्यू प्रोडक्ट एंड बहुत दिनों के मेहनत के बाद ही फाउंड ए कंपनी कॉल्ड शार्ट हु बॉट दैट डिवाइस पेटेंट फॉर वन पॉइंट फाइव मिलियन डॉलर एंड he become millionaire 
at the age of 19. How amazing is that? He also imported space game arcade machines to bars and restaurants. Basically, he wants to hustle. He was working 24-7 not only for the money but he was loving what he was doing then. And then at the early 80s, he started a company suggested by his old mentor called SoftBank. In their early days, they were struggling because Masa ke paas koi bhi software ka experience nahi tha. Close employees bhi resign kar rahe the because company's figures unke billion dollar ambition ko match nahi kar rahe the. Zabardast marketing ke baad bhi it didn't took off till early 90s. Everybody was telling him to stop but he kept dropping more and more money bombs and fortunately till mid 90s he successfully catered a large Japanese number with his software and has a billion dollar in revenue but he never laid down that money. He knew that later on the AI and tech will rule so he started investing in various tech companies and then in 1995 he invested in an unknown brand called Yahoo whose valuation became 40 million that time. In that same year Yahoo had its IPO and company's valuation become 808 million and he became rich. In 1995, he invested 40 million in E-Trade after a single call with the CEO. At the very threshold of late 90s, SoftBank became more like a venture capital company rather than a software company. And in year 2000, Masa realized that not all investments are good similarly like his ideas but only one good stake can level up the ground and then he invested 20 million dollars in an unknown brand called Alibaba. The founder Jack Ma initially declined the offer as he was not sure of it. But it was Masa who truly saw the spark in Jack's eyes. He had no business plan, zero revenue, but his eyes was very strong. And in 14 years, that 20 million stake became mind-boggling 90 billion dollar. He became the richest man in the world for straight three days. And then the dot-com bubble burst. He loses almost 70 billion dollars overnight, the largest amount that any investor had ever lost in history. This accident could have slowed any of us down. But he's Masasan. He started betting bigger and taking more risks. He also dipped his hand into broadband business by threatening the government official that he will set himself on fire if they did not help him. Then Masa launched a broadband service with half a price of their competitors. Initially, they lost millions but he was assured that profit will follow by adding add-on services. And that's what Geo did with us. In mid-twenties, he already identified that the globe will shift into a smaller version of PC called phone. So he called one of his knights Steve Jobs and share his idea about phone. Then Steve told him that they are working on a similar project called iPhone. After hearing that, Masa rushed to him and want to have the exclusive right to sell iPhone in Japan. Steve laughed hard and said, you crazy, we are not sure of launching it and you want to sell it. He also added that Masa did not own any mobile phone carrier in Japan. Then Masa simply replied, I will. And fair enough, he took a 20 million debt for Vodafone Japan in late 2006. Due to this perseverance, he managed to sell iPhone with a very lower price in Japan. And the market then was very excited to try out that new product. After having an access of phone, Masa speculated that AI will emerge. So he invested in robot companies who can literally understand human emotions. He was moving at such a pace that no other investor in the world can think of. He also wanted to invest in all those billion dollar companies in their early days due to lack of fund or I would say money was stuck somewhere else. It didn't happen. For example, he once met Jeff Bezos to invest in Amazon in early days. But unfortunately, it didn't happen. And after that, Masa was so desperate not to miss out on the next Amazon or Tesla. So he came up with an idea that he could never face any limitations again. His vision fund, a hundred billion dollar venture capital fund, which is four times larger than any other previous capital fund in history. I told people you were going to raise a hundred billion dollar fund. Did they tell you you were a little crazy? Well, some people said. When people are busy thinking he was crazy, he was writing his fate in Saudi Arabia. The country is full of oil money and Arab prince Mohammed bin Salman wants to invest his country's money to shift country's economic state. In one hour, you convinced him to invest $45 billion. No, no. 45 minutes, 
45 billion dollars. Uh, 1 billion dollars per minute. Yes, in a meeting of 45 minutes, he successfully gathered the initial fund of 45 billion dollars and the rest of the money was poured by SoftBank itself and companies like Apple and Foxconn. Eventually, he successfully executed his plan of vision fund, a 100 billion dollar fund. So we are investing 100 billion dollars just on one thing, AI. He all invested in AI. In near future, AI will dominate the market. As his previous prediction, this time he want to bet big on AI. Masa also quote himself, I hope to be remembered as a crazy guy who bets on future. He invested in many companies but not all were went straight through the line. And you know what, there is a dark side of Masa-san also. By investing so much money, he sometimes inflate the true value of the company and that's why the company failed to survive. Example, Vivo. Many accused him of using money as a weapon and giving threat to the founder that he will invest money on his rivals. So eventually, at the end of the day, the founder has to take the money from Masa. He also has have a habit in investing in rivals like Snapdeal and Flipkart. He pours so much money on companies as he can literally move the market. But after all, he is living the true definition of entrepreneur, taking on financial risk. And in 2019, Masa said aim a little higher cause Vision Fund 2 is coming. But after a year, his speculations look unstable. But who knows, after all, he is the craziest billionaire guy, Masa-san.